Hello everyone, my name is Gothic Lord UK. I'm still playing demos of puzzle games from Steam. This is a slug's dream. So far, no audio. I assume that's going to come in very imminently. Skipping dinner was a mistake. Now you'll find out. Now you'll dream about delicious flowers, but you'll have to find them elsewhere. Intro one. Okay, I am too long. So I can cover the gap and. Okay, I can go in and out of the portals. And then... Fire burns you. Z to undo, R to reset. Okay. Oh, well, I'm going to need... First of all, I need that. Oh! Interesting. If I back up into something, it can fall over. Duly noted. Intro three. What is... What is going on? Oh. All right, we're really getting some, like, can of wormholes back into this, move forwards into that kind of mechanics. River one. Right. You crushed a flower. Oh, yeah. Can I crush? The water is cold. Okay. So I need to cross this river. I can climb up that. I can look behind here for clues. I can climb up, but I can't move laterally or climb up higher once I've done so. Okay. So if I come back over here. Or if I push this backwards then. Oh, I make myself a little tunnel. Adorable. Is there any flowers hiding back there? No. All right, then let's spin around. The music really quiet for you guys. Probably a bit better. Reach one. Okay. We need to get up and over. So, if I use that one being tall, and this one being wide, but not there, I do it here, get that cursor off the screen, and now I can climb up here. Then, how am I going to get them both back? Because I need to repeat this on the other side, don't I? That's interesting. That's there. And I can push this over next to it. Then I can go up. Then my problem becomes, I can push this over as far as I want. That's fine. But I can't push this backwards towards me. Oh, that's interesting, though. Ah, no, it's not. Oh, wait. Can, mm, it was one closer to me. I could move it down. I can move it along with this, I assume, pushing it side to side. But that's going to be 
tricky, isn't it? Because it's symmetrical, so... If I did that... No. Not that. How can I get a tall piece back after doing this? I can't climb on that without resistance, so that's no good to me. And I can't climb up above this. I don't need the long piece. I can climb up with just a flat piece. What was I thinking? I can do that. But then I can't retrieve this again, right? Do I need to? How did I do the first one on the left? Ah, oh, it's not symmetrical. Okay, that's really important. It is not symmetrical. So, which side do I want to prioritize if it's not symmetrical? Probably. Can I get to that flower and back now? No, I'm too short. I'm going to need the other tall piece. In some capacity. Because I can't do this on both sides. But then... How am I going to get these two to cooperate in helping me get to that flower at the back? Is the big question. Because I can't retrieve either of these from these positions as far as I can tell. It's that back flower that's really the trouble here. Because I can't get across this gap to retrieve the long piece either. Oh, I can do that. Yes. Okay. That's not going to do it. But now... We can, we can work with this. We can work with this. We got it. Why is this not black? Did I miss a flower? Nope, now it's black. Interesting. Arch. Okay, we've got some climbing to do, clearly. We know we can climb up one apiece. Good. Not that fast. Reach two. Oh, God. Okay, well... Probably... Gonna need... 
something like this for a start. Then what about just that? Because I can go one over the gap here, one over the gap there. That's nice and simple. Portals. Oh, God. Oh, God. That's all kinds of strangely uncomfortable. So with the red ones, we go into the light and out of the dark. Oh, into the light and out of the light on the two longer pieces. Chasm. Back with portals. If I do this. If I do... I can't do that. Can I push this around? I can. I can take it. I can't move that around. That's expected. Okay, can I push this through that? I can. And then if I back up through here, I cannot do that. Uh, well then, this is fine, because all I need to do is push this over so that it's long before it goes through the teleporter. Then I can come out of here, use the ledge that I've created for myself, eat the flowers. Chasm 2. That's a big, big old chasm. That's there. Oh, interesting. I can teleport water through it. What happens if I do this, though? Uh, can I now just use this as, like... No idea if that's the intended solution, but it's the solution that I found. <laughs> Right, going up. Fire. Oh god, okay, so... More portals. That burns. That also burns. Interesting. Can I extinguish fires in a way that will give me a path through. If I move this down... Right, so the piece underneath there is still on fire. But even though it's been crushed, it hasn't been extinguished. Good thing to know. But I can't touch the water or the fire. So where... Do I stand to make this work for me? Can I rotate this around so that it's facing different directions? Because with enough rotations, you'd figure you could, right? That get, dips my tail in the water. If 
That crushes a flower, so I do this here instead. Then I still get burnt by the first piece. What if I do that over that way and this over the alternate way? No, I still can't make water underneath me. It would seem that with enough moves, I should be able to orient the water to come in any direction, right? If I do that... Crushed a flower. There you go. All right, we went far off. Fire two. Oh, jeez. Interesting that the flowers are all on the right. Nothing going on back there. What if I do that? Or better. And then, can I push this in front of that to stop the water? Very nice. Right, we're going that direction. Is all of this demo available to me? Apparently. Um... I need to go in the light side of this. So if I put that, no, I can't push it that way. If I put it up against here, I can climb on the wall, eat the flower and then leave. I'm really, really starting to enjoy this. There's a lot of mechanics to work with here and I appreciate it. Right, so how am I gonna get both of these working for me? I want to push that back or something. Because once I've done that, I can't cross that line of water. Nor can I cross that line of water. If I just put them both face down, I'd probably give myself a lot more freedom to work with, right? much easier hole oh jeez uh can't move that one up top There's the hole in the bricks that's going to give me grief here, I think. I can move this 
If I set that to be face down, I can push it wherever I want it. Ah. And retrace your steps using Z. Okay, so it remembers what I was doing. That's cool. Then what? To get up again. I am not sure what we've got going on up here. High one and high two. We've got a green teleporter. It doesn't work when I'm obstructing my own end. That's just a bit of good fun. if we do this not much there's a gap in the bricks there so I need to climb much higher how am I going to climb higher with what we have here great question I can't put green on top of red or can I? I can. How does this help me? I have to go around the corner if I want to get past the fire, right? Oh, this is good. Ooh. No. I was like, could I use the green one to extinguish the fire? But I don't think I can. I'm really just not sure what the green one in the wall is for. Can't turn that on its side while I'm there. No, I'm getting a. Uh, I'm getting stuck more and more here. Where's my entry? Over here. That's going to be even trickier, I assume. What other sections do we have here? Didn't I solve this? I thought I solved that one. It hasn't turned black. Not sure why. Desert 1 and 2. Thanks for trying the demo. Alright, let's try Desert 1. Right, I'm guessing if I touch the cacti... Cactus hurts your tummy. Cute. Interesting. These are separate pieces. Can I? No, I can't just climb this, can I? But how can I keep them on top of one another if I need to be higher? If the first push is going to move that out. Um, if I push with my back, nothing happens. That one's easy enough. This guy here. I don't have resistance to climb from here. Oh, I know what I can do. I'm silly. Uh, if I put this here... And then put it upright. Then I can climb. Simple stuff, mate. Simple stuff. Right, so... No other locations here. Couple of puzzles here I didn't solve, but that's fine. 
Is there a secret puzzle? Just here. There is a secret puzzle. How am I going to get water to that very high point? No. Can I climb up it now? I can. No! <laughs> There's fire there. I do this. I then get wet. And I can't retrace the steps of the long piece. However, if this is not long... Then I can get the flower. Ace. Alright, I found your secret level. I would definitely love to see in the full game some level of like connected mystery within the navigation of the overworld here. Obviously I'm a sucker for that stuff, but that would be really nice to see. But there's some really wonderful ideas here. And this will definitely be one to watch coming into 1.0 down the line. Alright, well, I think I'm going to call it there. There's obviously those couple of puzzles I didn't get, but I've got no beef with that. Through here, thanks for trying the demo. Is there... There's a level behind here, but you can't currently step into it. I don't see a way to do anything to move stuff to get into that portal. All right, well. Is there a main menu? Don't think so. Right, that was the slug stream. Check it out for yourself with the links down in the description below. Otherwise, thank you ever so much for watching. If you're enjoying the series of demos, if you have any recommendations or all of that good stuff, put them down below. Hit that like button, subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.